Okay, so we're gonna start working on partner kick number three. I just wanna introduce the sweeping technique and the jumping technique that are in number three so you could practice it before you jump in with a partner. Okay, for this one, number three, it's helpful to, to not have a partner in front of you. So the very first thing we're gonna do, just like uh, our first you know, two partner kicks, we're gonna start in a cat stance. Our first kick is going to be a cross kick. So we're gonna step down and we're gonna slap with the right hand and then we're going to cross kick with the right foot. Okay, so again, from a cat stance, uh, left leg in front, you're going to slap with the right, cross kick with the right, and then you see I could just turn around. So you could practice this like maybe 10 more times. Let's do maybe three together. We have step down, slap, cross kick, and turn, and two, slap, cross, and turn, and we'll just do one more time together. Slap, kick, and then turn. Okay, so the Slapping with the right, cross kicking with the right, pretty easy. Now, after we kick with the right, boom, we're gonna put our foot down into somewhat of an elephant stance. So you remember elephant stance, of course. Now from here, we're gonna sweep, okay? So elephant stance to sweep, steel stance behind, and then your right leg is going to swing around. As you swing the right leg around, your hands are gonna swing opposite to your uh, foot, okay? I'll do this again facing the other way, off of the uh, cross kick, we have our right leg in front, elephant stance. Your hands stay up in guard. You're going to steel stance behind and sweep. Let's just try this a couple more times. We have our cross kick, which brings our right leg in front, and then we steel stance and we sweep, and then heading back. Tying it together, we have our kick, and then step and sweep. We have kick, step, sweep, kick, Step, sweep, and we'll do one more time. Cross kick, steel stance, and sweep, and then hands up. So that is one side of partner kick number three. Okay, doing the cross kick into the sweep. Practice that a lot until you have it, and then we'll do the other side as well. Okay, so let's do the second side of partner kick number three. This uses your dinbo jump, all right? We're gonna start with our left leg in front and our right hand out. So somewhat important for the, you know, for the sake of the partner exercise is that you have this specific starting position. Right hand, left leg, okay, opposite hands and feet. When you get kicked, that's your cue to step back, okay? So either to arrow stance or elephant stance. Your partner's gonna try to knock this leg out, knocking out your right leg, and you are going to dinbo to cat stance, okay? So I'll do this a couple more times in this direction. Left leg, right hand, opposite hands and feet. You get kicked and you take a step. And then right from here, when they go to sweep, you dinbo jump to cat stance. Okay, one more time in this direction. I have opposite hands and feet, get kicked, take a step, and dinbo jump. And that's it, so practice that a whole bunch and then we'll work on this as a partner exercise. Okay, good job. Okay, so now that you have both sides of partner kick number three, let's do this one with the partner. Okay, so here we go. Uh, we are going to start, we are the kicking side. I'm gonna scoot back a bit. We're gonna start just like we did a moment ago with the left leg in front cast stance. Your partner has opposite hands and feet, left, right. We are gonna slap the hand and kick the hand, bam, bam. And now we're gonna sweep for this leg. As soon as we start moving, that's your cue to jump, okay? So if you're on the jumping side, as soon as you see the forward movement, that's your cue to jump. We step sweep and you dinbo jump. Now you notice in this position, when Michael jumped out of the way, he jumped to the corner. This sets him up to kick the groin, kick the guts, depending on how far he jumped. He's jumping a little small so he can stay in the frame but you're jumping not straight back, slightly off the line, and your cat stance should be pointing straight at your partner to counter kick to the groin, uh, kick to the legs, do whatever you want, or just move forward uh, with your footwork. So you always dimbo jump slightly to your corner. Let's try this one a few more times on the exact same side. Again, ready? We have slap and cross kick, and sweep. Again. <clears throat> slap, cross. Step, sweep, and one more time, and go. And that's it, okay? Partner kick number three, keep it up, practice that.